success success is a buzzword nowadays you are hearing from all the sources everybody of us want to be successful right but so you must be agree that success is your biggest plan success is your determination because after all the success gives you fulfillment happiness right so it's your biggest project in your life so my friends do you know that every successful project or goal or plan must have some prerequisites some basic requirements so the success is it's your project after all right thank you narendra girase for joining today i am talking about the first requirement prerequisites of success first and the most important and i'm going to tell you but you may think that kailash has nothing to share much because but i take that risk i take that risk and i say have your own dream this is the first requirement why not it's too important having your dream is too important because this how we can talk about tree and its branches leaves and stem if we don't talk about its root the root and here root is your dream your dream to be successful is your root for being successful so have one dream and because why dream is important because dream has one special quality some special qualities this dream will ask you to concentrate thank you any i will be concentrate it concentrate your power it change your state of mind it strength your effort it streamline your efforts that qualities dream have so my friends first requirement is have your own dream requirement number 2 ready to be committed today i was reading this book the giant within awaken the giant within by tony robbins when i was reading the first chapter of this book it was saying that how tony robbins from mere thank you deepika ji for how tony robbins become world famous leader from just office boy and how he is now roaming in a private jet and this because but even i shared his dream of being motivational speaker but i refused i thought that i could never do that i could never fly in private jet but one for one thing do you notice that i not only refuses his glamorous life but what i refused is i refused to put those 8 years of continuous efforts 8 years of sleepless nights whatever he committed i refuses to do that and for everything my friends if you have a dream it is you can you can have your dream and also expect the results if you have your dream so you can expect the result and yes surely you should expect the results but along with that 
you should be committed. You should be committed to put that number of efforts, whatever required to be successful. The point number two, commitment to put efforts. Prerequisite number three, accept the responsibility. You should accept the responsibility of each and everything happen in your life. If you start accepting the responsibility, you start getting the result, you start getting the credits. For example, if you are studying, you are practicing some foreign language, and if you are not able to understand their pronunciation, then it's you take the responsibility to be careful listener. In the other hand, if they are not able to understand your pronunciation, then take that responsibility to be better speaker. On the both way, responsibility on you and you will see the result, how you are getting. If the world, if you are seeing the problems in this world, then recognize them. And Try to solve them yourself. Take that responsibility. And I tell you, there are two ways to solve the problems. One is to change the world. And another is to, is to change yourself. And I think you are intelligent enough to choose whom you, want, you are going to change. World or yourself. So take that responsibility. Point number four, willingness to ask for help and feedback and support. My friends, nowadays I am reading another book by Jack Canfield, Aladdin Factor. That book tells about how to ask. My friends, asking is not a weakness. It speed up your efforts. It speed up your speed. So ask. Ask politely. Because it teaches us so, much, so many things. For asking, you should be polite. For, and if somebody supports you, then you should be, respond with gratitude. So asking has so much thing. And Start understanding the feedback. Ask for feedback. Feedback can be direct, indirect, positive, negative, by the guides, by the critics, anything. Feedbacks are most important. And do you know that? Which feedback is most important? Feedback we got from negative points. Feedback you got from the failure. Feedback from rejection, feedback from opposition. Those are the most important feedbacks. So my friends, consider that this rejection, failure, or opposition are just the source of your feedback, not the roadblocks. So keep continued. And Fifth one, you should be ready to be patient because, do you know that? What is mean by patient in medical terms? Patient means who is sustaining beyond, sustaining beyond sufferings. And if one is not sustained beyond the sufferings, then he is considered as dead. So same happens with your dreams. If, because being successful is, has so much suffering, it is hard work. And you have to sustain beyond it. And if you can't sustain, that means you are, if you can't sustain, means your dreams are dead.
So my friends, success is really slow process. Success means you are building the big hill out by your hands. So be patient and continue your hard work. And sixth one, most important, and last one, do not read books. Yes, you heard it right. Do not read books. Because reading books, that mere pieces of paper makes you feel ignorant that how stoop, how ignorant you were before reading this book. Let me give you an example. I am reading these two books, two books about public speaking. And those two books are giving me realization that how stupid, how bad public speaker I am. So why should I read the books? Rather than that, I have another book by Tony Robbins, this $10 book, what he teaches me. Rather than that, I can directly call to Tony Robbins. I can set one hour of meeting with him and he can teach me, no matter. He may charge me $5,000 or $10,000 or, or for example, I can ask directly Gandhiji to tell me about his experiments of truth. But nowadays he is residing in uh, heaven. So I have to die for it. So my friends, hope you got the message. Read the books. And do not only read the books, leave them, eat them, talk them, whatever. Do with the book. Those are best guys. So those are some prerequisites. You might have so many others, but those are from mine. So I hope I wish you best of luck for your success journey. Thank you very much for being online and sharing and liking my video. Thank you.